What's up everyone, it's Colin from ironstechnologyblog.com and today I have a quick demo of an app that is probably going to change forever how you control access um, or how you control your kids access to things like apps, to the internet um, and basically uh, you're, <laughs> you're going to be able to hold this over their head and make them pretty much do whatever you want uh, to ensure that they get access to their apps and their tablets and stuff like that um, because obviously um, with recent news you know things like the Ryan Tuberty show on RTE showing off um, how easy it is for children to be tricked um, on apps like Kick or Snapchat and stuff like that so you know we got to keep them safe and we're all probably a little bit guilty of letting them have a bit too much internet access and potentially unmonitored internet access uh, to a degree. So uh, without any more messing about I have one of my kids tablets and I have my own phone. So the app we're going to be talking about today is called Our Pact. Now I've tried a lot of um, apps over the years uh, from kids modes to you know to, to other versions of apps that supposedly will control your tablet and allow your kids uh, to have X amount of time or something like that. So this is a Samsung Galaxy Tab A6 and Samsung make probably the best kids mode uh, out there. There's there's nothing, there's no other kids mode on any other tablet that I've used certainly that is, is as good as it. Um, it basically, you kind of, you know, fence off all the apps that you want them to have access to and that's all they can access to. They can't get out of the, um, can't get out without going through a pin um, so it's all really really safe but the most you can really do with any of these sort of kids mode apps is really set time limits as to what they can play uh, you can't restrict individual apps so for example Roblox is one app now that's uh, particularly popular in my house and probably is in thousands of other houses um, and like it's a kid's game, you can't really say no to them when their friends have it and genuinely, for the most part, it's perfectly um, innocent. But there's aspects of it, um, you know, where some kids get aggressive, some kids just, you know, they just freak out altogether and can't handle it when they don't have a certain app or game that they want to play. So our pact will work uh, in tandem with whatever tablet your child has, whether it has a kid's mode or doesn't have a kid's mode. Um, so right now, uh, we'll just take you into the app, first of all, on the phone. So uh, the app is here called Our Pact, and I've actually set up all my kids on it. So across the top here, you have, you know, each child represented by a different picture. So for this child, um, you can set up schedules as to, you know, what hours and what days they're allowed to have their tablets. So the way this works is I have a Friday, Saturday schedule. So on those days between 7.30 p.m. and 7.30 a.m., they have zero access to anything on their tablet. Not just the internet, but anything they try and open on their tablet will be blocked out. Uh, Sunday, their, their access ends at 7.15 p.m. and it doesn't come back on until the following Monday at 9 a.m. And then on a weekday, because of school, um, their access is restricted from 6 p.m. until 9 a.m. the following day. So we give the kids a little bit of time during the weekday once all their homework and stuff like that is done. But even better than that, um, you can get down to really, um, you know, you can really drill down. So if you want to block just specific apps, you have basically every app that's listed on, that's on this tablet is on my phone in the parent version of the Hour Packed app. So if you don't want them having access to Snapchat ever, no matter what your schedule is, just tick uh, this this uh, disallow button. So for example, they have no access to Chrome, no access to email, no access to Google Drive. Uh, everything with the time means they have access based on their schedule. Um, so for example, if we look right now, on this one of the kids this is my kid so one of his tablet so here he has access currently based on his schedule uh, however you can come in and manually block for example 
if you want it, if he's been bold, uh, even within a schedule, you could block him out. And you do that, it'll say block pending. And you just give it a moment. And any second now, that will just change to uh, to always block. I think I picked until I say so. You could you could block them for, you know, five minutes, ten minutes, any number of time. So if I just go back out here, we will see now if it has activated. And there you go. So on screen down here, it'll say RPAC Junior, you'll have free time tomorrow, or basically, you know, whenever I decide to uh, to give them access back. So that'll work for any app. So for example, Minecraft. It's gone. So nothing at all will work. Even if we got into kids mode or adult mode, and this is, this is where it's great, even if your tablet doesn't have a dedicated kids mode, you can happily let them use adult mode, restrict every single app on the device other than the ones you want them to have access to, uh, and it's perfectly safe. They can't get into settings uh, or do anything like that. So here it is in adult mode now. Roblox blocked um, and it is excellent and I, I haven't found any other app that will do this as well as this. Um, other things you can do within it, uh, so within your schedule you can also then assign uh, allowances. So the schedule says they're allowed access between this time and this time but maybe you only want to give them two hours access so you can turn that on um, and give them whatever number of hours access during the during the schedule. Uh, for kids who are a little bit older perhaps and maybe are out and about, uh, if they have a mobile phone with them, you can track them using the locator tab. Uh, I won't turn it on now because it'll give away my location. Um, so you could turn this on now and you will see where they are, assuming they have their phone on them, um, down to you know a couple of feet from where they're standing. Uh, based on the GPS. Um, so, as I said, I haven't found anything as good as this. It has been working perfectly uh, for all four devices that I've set up with the kids. Um, so I better, better give him his access back when he comes home. Um, it's called Hour Pact. Uh, and basically what you do is you put the Hour Pact Junior uh, app onto the child's device. You go through some setup tasks and then you uh, log in to the, um, to the parent version essentially on your device and then you set up your schedules and that's pretty much it. it it's, it's set it up and forget about it almost to, to a large degree. Um, the one thing would be nice for a future version of the app is that you could copy the schedules from one child to another. At the moment there's no way to do that, you set them up manually uh, on each child, um, which is no bad thing, but it would be nice to have a copy uh, option. So uh, now the bad news, it is not free, uh, but like all good things, um, you know, they rarely are free. So uh, in this case, you have a, an option of um, a freemium version of it, which will basically give you uh, one device, one schedule, uh, but you then can't block individual apps uh, uh, within that particular price tier. Uh, there's a $1.99, $1.99 a month option, which would give you a little bit more. Uh, again, it doesn't give you the app blocking feature. Or you have the premium, which is $6.99 a month uh, for up to 20 devices, I believe. Uh, unlimited locks, unlimited grants, unlimited blocks. And that's the one I've done. Um, and you might be thinking six ninety nine a month is is quite a bit, um, but uh, certainly works, and I've had no issues at all um, with it. A couple of little setup problems at the start, but now that they're ironed out, um, everything is fine. Um, so that's called Our Pact, and if you go to your Google Play Store, it will look like this: Our Pact Parental Control and screen time manager um, and there you go I can highly recommend it um, it is it is very very good and you know if if your child is 
if you think maybe having too much access to the internet and is on your tablets too long, um, certainly check it out. Um, so just follow the link in the description below. And please don't forget to hit subscribe and the little notification bell if you want to be notified when we uh, post a new or a new video. So uh, thanks for watching. This is Ireland's Technology Blog .com.